In Taurus, what you can also do is once you have your design set up, then you can also do some, uh, some speed checks which are dynamic. So again, as you move the central island location, it's not only the roundabout, which is uh, the roundabout geometry, which is updated continuously, but if you focus on this, uh, on this dialog box on the left-hand side, you see that the speeds measured for every approach are also dynamically updated. So this gives a very good feedback to designers that when they design a roundabout and they have uh, a particular movement which could be problematic because of high speeds, they can figure out where to place uh, the central island of the roundabout or whether to perhaps increase the diameter of the central island so vehicles have uh, uh, a bigger deflection uh, to take from, from the ideal path. Therefore, they need to reduce their speed 